Hi, this is Rian from Must Be Noob. This lab guide is on how to enable self service password reset in Microsoft Entra ID using Microsoft Entra Admin Center. Self service password reset is a Microsoft Entra ID feature that enables users to reset their passwords without contacting IT staff for help. If a user's account is locked, or they forget the password, they can use self-service password reset to unlock themselves and get back to the work. You can enable self-service password reset for selected users or all users. Microsoft Entra ID P1 or P2 license is required for any user that you intend to benefit from the self-service password reset. Access Microsoft Entra Admin Center as a global administrator. Click on Go to Microsoft Entra ID. As the best practice, create a pilot group to contain users who will be first testing the self-service password reset. Click on Groups and select All Groups. Click on SSPR Pilot GRP1. This is the group which I have created to test self-service password reset. I have added Tomcat as a member of this pilot group. Click on protection and select password reset. Choose selected group option under self-service password reset enabled. You can enable self-service password reset for all users in your tenant. But initially, I'm going with pilot group. Click on No Groups Selected. Select Pilot Group Name SSPR Pilot GRP1. Click on Select. To enable self service password reset for the selected group, select Save. Microsoft suggests you enable self service password reset for all users. When users need to unlock their account or reset their password, they are prompted for another confirmation method. This extra authentication factor makes sure that Microsoft Entra ID finished only approved SSPR events. You can choose which authentication methods to allow based on the registration information the user provides. Select Authentication Methods. Set the number of methods required to reset password to 2. This will make it more secure. Choose the methods available to users that your organization wants to allow. For this lab, check the boxes to enable mobile app notification, mobile app code as well. To apply the authentication methods, select Save. Before users can unlock their account or reset a password, they must register their contact information. An administrator can manually provide this contact information or users can go to a registration portal to provide the information themselves. Set up Microsoft Entra ID to prompt the users for registration the next time they sign in. Select Registration. You can see by default Require users to register where sign in option is set to yes. That means users have to provide the information themselves. You can set number of days before users are asked to reconfirm the authentication information. By default, this value is set to 180 days. It is important to keep the contact information up to date. If outdated contact information exists, when a self-service password reset event starts, the user may not be able to unlock their account or reset their password. If you have changed any settings on registration page, select Save to save the changes. To keep users informed about account activity, you can set up Microsoft Entra ID to send email notifications when a self-service password reset event happens. These notifications can cover both regular user accounts 
and admin accounts for admin accounts this notification provides another layer of awareness when an privileged administrator account password is reset using self service password reset microsoft entra id will notify all global admins when someone use self service password reset on an admin account to configure it select notifications set notify users on password reset option to yes if it is set to no set notify all admins when other admins reset the password to yes click on save to save the changes you did successfully configure self service password reset for selected group of users open new browser window in in private mode type myaccount.microsoft.com and press enter key tap the username to sign in and click on next enter user password and click on sign in in the more information required dialog box select next since i have selected two methods required to reset user password it is asking us to register those information app and phone click on next to set up microsoft authenticator app click on next scan this qr code in microsoft authenticator app to add this account to microsoft authenticator app once you add the account to microsoft authenticator app click on next now you need to enter this number in microsoft authenticator app to approve this sign in once the sign in is approved you will see a notification notification approved click next now you need to register your phone number so let me complete the process after entering the phone number for registration click on next enter the verification code received on provided mobile number click on next you can see the message sms verified your phone number was registered successfully after your phone number has been registered select next you have successfully set up your security information and you have added two method for self service password reset choose done to continue sign in process you are now registered to use self service password reset click on yes to stay signed in user tomcat is now registered to use self service password reset with two methods let's sign out from my account portal in this lab guide you have learned how to configure self service password reset for selected group of users in microsoft entra id that's all for this lab guide stay tuned for more videos like this see you all in the next lab guide